swish and sweets and some weed i'm rolling up rolling up smear the inside with some dabs i'm rolling up rolling up i'm going to puff until i'm smoked i'm rolling up rolling up thanks for rolling up to but marley and this is a certified pie hit smoking on one of my uh evening eat them it's night time it's night time it's night time split um you want to be jumping into these uh, cannabis conspiracy theories. Today's conspiracy theory involves the fountain of youth. We're going to be talking about what exactly was the fountain of youth. Now, this theory says that the legendary fountain of youth wasn't a fountain at all, but it was a field of marijuana that reversed aging in those that smoked it. Let's take a journey back to the 1500s. Imagine a ragged group of explorers led by the notorious Juan Ponce de leon trucking through the humid bug ridden swamps of florida in search of that mythical fountain of youth i'm sure these guys was desperate once at sea surviving on dried biscuits and whatever passed for meat back then so when they heard about a magical fountain they could cure their aches and wrinkles they leapt at the opportunity but here's where the story takes a wild turn they weren't actually searching for a fountain of youth no what they stumbled upon was a lush sprawling field of you got it dank buds they didn't find some enchanted spring they found an enchanted weed field and suddenly the whole legend makes sense instead of sipping from a magical spring they smoking something that made them feel young again here's a riddle i'm invisible but you feel me when i'm near you know it's time to hurry what am i so picture this ponce and his crew have been hacking through the jungle for weeks and their skin looked like old leather and their back sounded like a bag of popcorn every time they moved. They stumbled across like a local tribe lounging around smoking some mysterious herb. And these people weren't just relaxed. They chilling. They lounging, bro. They limber and, and athletic. They don't look like they've been in the jungle struggling, climbing trees and nothing. They look healthy. Now naturally, Ponce and his boys decided to give it a try. And a few pumps later... Boom! Their aches melt away, their spirits lift, and suddenly they feel 20 years younger. They didn't magically grow like new hair or reverse their crow's feet, but they felt like they could tackle a crocodile. Here's another one. The more you stretch me, the stronger I get. But if you pull too hard, I split. What am I? Here's where things get even more interesting. Cannabis in real life has anti-inflammatory infl- infl- in real life cannabis has anti-inflammatory inflammatory properties yo I, I might have to i might have to stop trying to say words to y'all it can reduce puffiness ease joint pains and help you feel pretty damn good so it's not entirely out of the question that ponce de leon and his homies after smoking some super green dank were convinced that they found the secret to eternal youth. Imagine them gazing into the distance, skin glowing, joints cracking, less than thinking, this is it, bro. We cracked the code. Sure, they still look like dried blueberries, but mentally, they felt like kids again. When your brain says, hey, you 20, bro. You could be 80 and you 20, bro. Now, here's the thing, right? I like to think that the legend of the fountain of youth might have even started off as a joke, right? Some explorer, after smoking a little bit too much, says, Man, this stuff makes me feel young. We should tell people we found a fountain of youth. And everybody laughed and agreed. Let's face it, they were all very high, though. And the thing is, legends spread quickly. So that first little nah, I mean puff up. Next thing you know, people back in Europe are talking about a magical fountain, when in reality, it was just a killer strain of weed and a misunderstanding. Imagine the disappointment when people start looking for a fountain and instead found a field of plants. Here's another riddle for it. I am round on both ends and high in the middle. What am I? If there's one thing that um cannabis is known for, it's helping people sleep. And let's be real. After months of tossing and turning on a hard ship, these dudes probably got the best sleep in their lives. After smoking that dank, woke up feeling refreshed with a bounce in their step and fewer aches. And sleep is magical. Break and hell, refresh. Let's be honest, bro, it's the closest thing to a time machine that we got. So while they aren't actually aging backwards, these explorers felt rejuvenated. Ponce probably woke up, stretched, thought, man, uh, I can probably do the 40 in like four seconds. They were to do the 40 or that back then. Let's not forget about the pine trees that were probably surrounding the magical field, right? Pine trees have a common scent that can make you feel like you're in some sort of spot. 
not deep in a dangerous like mosquito infested swamp but like you're in an effervescent field and then you smoking on top of that bro when you in the ward off astoria with the scent applying in the air and effects of cannabis I'm pretty sure the exhaustion they felt just melted away bro and then boom Legend of the Fountain of Youth is born, bro. And it didn't need to be an actual fountain. Like, you wouldn't just say, I just found a field of youth. It just sounds better saying the fountain of youth. Here's another joke for you, bro. Well, it's not a joke, it's a real. I am found in socks, scarves, and mittens. And often in the paws of playful kittens. What am I? At the end of the day, right? The Legend of the Fountain of Youth may not have been about water at all. Maybe the explorers didn't need to find some enchanted spring. They just needed a good joint. Imagine the irony of it all. Ponce on and his crew went on a dangerous quest for immortality, only to stumble upon a plant that gave them exactly what they were looking for, just not in the way they expected. No magical water, no mystical powers, just to feel the green that made them feel, even if just for a moment, like the youthful adventures they once were. Next time somebody tells you that the fountain of youth was an actual fountain, bruh, tell them that it might actually have been some dank, bro. The answers to the riddles. A deadline, Ohio, rubber band, yarn. Catch you on the next one.